Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. So I am blessing you guys two weeks in a row with color on my eyes. I never ever do this. Like I pretty much just like do color once a year. But I did purple last week and then I did blue this week. I was just really feeling that Michaela palette. Like I was looking at it and I was like, I am just so inspired. So I was just like messing with all the blues and like this is the closest top that I have that would match this. So I was like... Let's throw this on, let's rock a blue eyeshadow look, and let's talk about hair in this video, okay? So, if you guys have been following me for a while, or if you haven't, if you're new here, hi, how are you? I'm Danielle. Um, I have been on a hair journey for what feels like my entire life. Like, I recently had to cut my hair because it's a long story, I don't feel like getting into it, but I used to have hair like down to here pretty much, and then I went to this girl, and she kind of cut off way more than I said I want to cut off, and she completely bleached my hair, so I am on a complete like hair reformation, transformation, I don't know, I'm on a hair journey, okay? So a few years ago I had hair extensions, like I love long hair and I haven't had like super long hair in years because for whatever reason whenever my hair would get long I would just think it was a great idea to be like hey I'm gonna cut six inches off and that's it so I mean my hair has grown a lot I've been taking a lot of hair vitamins really really taking care of it the way I should be and it has grown a lot it used to be probably like an inch and a half shorter so we're, we're doing pretty good on length but for those girls that have short hair but want to really really enhance it I have your solution right here. We're going to be talking about ponytails today and just all of that jazz. So if you guys are interested, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and let's jump into this hair video. If you guys have heard of INH Hair, they're called Insert Name Here. Um, I will link them down below for you guys. I will link their Instagram for you. They have been all over social media for like the past few years. I've seen them with their ponytails, with their wigs, with their... um tools like they are just I feel like they are really kind of killing the game when it comes to hair and they I what I feel like they're known for is their ponytails because I see their ponytails all over Instagram all over YouTube I literally see them everywhere and I have some right here to share with you guys I have uh, Shayla and then I have Maya um, I have worn these in the past and I do kind of think I like Maya a little bit better because it kind of goes a little bit better with my hair texture but in this video I'm going to go into full details and how I put these in my hair how they feel the hair the quality all of that so my hair is pretty much straight right now I just kind of like blew it out it's about like two days dirty so this is like my two day old hair so I just kind of took my Dyson a few minutes ago and just blew it out really quickly so I'm going to show you guys how I insert this ponytail. So I'm going to start with Maya. So let me just take this out. These ponytails, guys, they feel so freaking nice. Like the hair quality is freaking amazing. So this is what Maya looks like. I have mine in the shade Honey. I'm actually just going to comb it through quick because it's been sitting in the bag for a few days. So I want to make sure. Ooh, I want to make sure it's perfect for the video. So I love this ponytail because it gives me heavy, like, Ariana Grande vibes. Like, you know how she's known for that, like, long pony? Like, that's pretty much all she wears. Yeah, this is giving me killer, killer Ariana Grande vibes. And, I mean, who doesn't want to look like Ariana Grande? Like, her hair is always, like, always on point. So this is what the pony looks like. As you can see, it does match, like, the bottom of my hair. Like, pretty much identical. They have so many different shades and I feel like if you have any color hair like you were pretty much bound to find find your match on their website. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do this. So first I'm going to take my bangs and put them in the front because I want to leave them out because a lot of my hair, like my roots is really really brown right now. So the like the front pieces of my hair are still obviously pretty blonde. So I want to keep those out because I want to show them. So I'm gonna take my wet brush. I'm just going to comb my hair I'm going to comb it just like how you would to get like a sleek type of ponytail so so this is pretty much what my hair looks like so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take a tight scrunchie I'm not going to take like one of those fluffy ones because I really want my hair to stay in place so I'm just going to tie it just like this and since my hair is a little dirty 
the oil in my hair is really going to keep my hair in place. So as you can see, this is what my hair looks like. There's really, there's not a whole lot like happening here. Like let's be pretty honest. Like my hair is pretty thin and whatnot. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take this pony. You guys, this hair feels so nice. It's incredible. So I wanna show you guys how this whole like application process works and how this looks. So I'm going to unfold it right now. This is Velcro, so it's really, really like easy to apply this. So as you can see, this is what it looks like. Oh my God, you guys, this hair is so soft. Like this is how I want my hair to be, seriously. So this is what it looks like. So as you can see, it has these little pins right here. These are going to get inserted into your hair right here. So right here is where you're going to insert it in the ponytail. This piece you're going to wrap around the ponytail so you can't see the Velcro. So like I said, I'm going to go into detail with you guys. So I'm going to kind of like turn around for this. This is going to be real complicated, but we are going to make it work. All right. How my pony is right now. So I'm going to take the pins and I'm going to insert them into the ponytail. You guys, this is so easy. It's like crazy how easy it is. So then I'm going to take this piece and I'm going to put it to the front so it doesn't get tangled in those other pieces. So now you can see how this looks. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, oh, where's the pony, okay. So I'm going to take it and I'm gonna wrap it like this and then I'm gonna take this piece now and I'm going to pull it very, very tightly because you want this to be super tight and I'm going to just wrap it around my hair you don't want this piece to get caught into the pony because then it can be a little difficult to do this. So really just keep it tight and don't try to rush this. So I'm just going to bring it all the way around. So as you guys can see, it is fully around my hair. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take this bobby pin, this comes with the pony, so you don't have to worry about buying bobby pins, and I'm going to take this piece and I'm going to put the bobby pin in it to really make it really secure. This is so hard to do on camera, but I promise you guys it's so easy in person. And then I'm going to do the same thing at the top of the ponytail to really make sure that it's nice and secure. And then I'm just going to feel around. Okay, so I actually went ahead and took out that second bobby pin because when I'm not doing it in front of a mirror, it's really hard to kind of like see and like I'm just really going off my feeling to kind of see like how everything is placed. So I went ahead and took it out because I looked at it and I was like, I don't need the second one. And I only have one in right now. And this bitch is secure. Like, trust me, this hair is not going anywhere. So what I will do now is I will take like some baby hairs like over here and just kind of pull them forward just to make it look a little more, just like put together, that's what I like to do. So, like I said, my hair is probably like a two days old right now. Yeah, I washed my hair like two days ago. So the grease and the oil in my hair is really what's keeping it nice and sleek. I have thinner hair, so I love when I wear like a sleek pony like this, like two days into not washing my hair because it really just makes it look so beautiful. So this is what it looks like, and as you can see, it really just blended over my natural hair so easily. Like, look at that. Oh, I love this ponytail so much. I literally feel like such just like, yeah, like, hi, like, I'm here. Like, can I help you? Do you need anything? Like, I have really long hair. Um, I have worn it straight up, but the way that I like it, I like it like this because I don't, I don't know, I just like my hair to be parted and just kind of sleeked down. This is how I'm into it, but you guys, I mean, this hair, it feels so freaking amazing. I can't even like believe how good this looks and how good this feels. And it's honestly like not that heavy. Like it is obviously an adjustment to if you're just used to wearing like your regular hair, but I don't even realize that it's in my head right now. Like that's how comfortable this is. Look at this. Oh God. And like I told you in the beginning of the video, I am on such a hair journey. So anything that I can do to kind of give that illusion, like, Hey, I have long, beautiful hair. Like I am going to do like 1000%. This just looks, oh my God, it literally looks so beautiful. I love it so much. Okay, so I just went ahead and showed you guys Maya. So now I want to show you guys Shayla. So obviously if you guys know Makeup by Shayla, then you know exactly who this collab is with. 
So they came out with a collab with her, I think around a year or so ago. And this one gives me like heavy, like, I don't even know, like princess vibes because of the style of this pony. It's so insane. Let me show you guys. So this is the Shayla one and this one just literally gives me such princess vibes. There's not as much hair in this one as there is in the other one. So this one is a little bit more lighter on your head. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I wear this one. So I am going to do the same thing with my bangs. I'm going to pull them out just like this. So this one, since I have straight hair, I'm going to have to put this one all the way up. So I'm just going to comb my hair back and up just like this. I like to keep that part in the middle still. That's just my personal preference. You guys can do this however, which way you choose. Getting my hair this high is a little bit difficult for me because I do have very, very thin hair. So it makes it pretty complicated for me, but this actually went up pretty easily. Like usually I have like little bald spots happening because my hair is going one way and I just, it's a hot mess. So this is pretty much what the pony looks like. So I'm going to take this ponytail, the Shayla one. Oh my god, it's so soft. And look at these waves, like so freaking beautiful. So I'm going to do the same thing. I did last time. I'm going to do the same thing I did last time. I'm going to take those clips and I'm going to insert it into the pony just like I did before. I'm going to take that piece that you wrap and I'm going to bring it forward. I'm going to wrap this side like this and then I'm going to take the piece that you're supposed to wrap around it and lean my head back and go right underneath that pony. I'm going to pull it very tight the same way I did last time. Doing this with no mirror, mirror is so hard, it's not even funny, so I'm just going to pull it and wrap it. Alright you guys, so this is what the pony looks like once it's in, and I know that I said the Maya was my favorite, but low-key this one is my favorite because this is the type of hair that I seriously wish, oh I gotta tuck that pony away, that I wish that I was blessed with because like this is just gorgeous just beautiful hair and I wish that my hair was this texture but this is what it looks like and it's so gorgeous like you can put some to the front and then keep some to the back and this just looks honestly beautiful and like I said it matches my hair color like the dye so perfectly and I just feel like a Disney princess like I seriously oh you can see my pony let me tuck that away I seriously feel like Jasmine in this I just feel like a Disney frigging princess in this like how beautiful like Alright you guys, so that completes this video. By the way, before I forget, I do have a coupon code for you guys. It's it's Danielle in all capitals. If you want to save some money, go ahead and put that in at checkout. It is not an affiliate code. I will have it linked down below. Not linked, but I will have it down below for you guys. Oh my god, my finger just got caught. If you guys were interested in getting some money off of these freaking killer ponytails, like I just can knock it over how this looks. It just looks like my dream hair. It's It's literally so crazy and the texture of this is so soft. And I thought that, like, these ponies would weigh people's heads down, but, like, yeah, it's heavy, but it's not, like, weighing me back. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's comfortable. Like, I'm not, like, over here dying to take this off. So, definitely love that. But yeah, so that's all I have for you guys in today's video. Please do not forget to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to follow Insert Name here on Instagram. Like I said, I will have all their stuff linked down below as well as that coupon code. So, as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please do not forget to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and to subscribe and I will hopefully catch you guys in my next video. Bye!